follow up on Senator Kane's um, questions having to do with the uh, additional uh, unemployment tax, mm -hmm. the 0.5%. Uh, yep. Can you tell us when uh, you and the Department of Labor knew that that was coming down the pike? Towards the end of, of 2014. And, and it's, an annual, it's an annual assessment. We knew it was coming. It was no surprise. As long as you continue to, to, to have money um, that you owe the federal government, you're always assessed a certain amount. And the longer you stretch it out, the higher that amount is, the percentage is. And do you know what type of outreach was made to um, the various um, employers in Connecticut telling them that this was going to um, – uh, start occurring so that um, they would be able to plan for it? They're always noticed. Um, I believe it's towards the end of the year, and I'm going to uh, ask Carl Grizzardi, who is our uh, director of that division, when that goes out. We, we have um, consistently issued communications uh, on a quarterly basis to employers, both via mail and electronically, since the federal unemployment insurance tax has been increasing since calendar year 2011, so there have been publications uh, issued by the agency. Uh, as Commissioner Palmer indicated, the exact federal tax increase is not known until the very latter stages of each year, and it depends on uh, the amount of the indebtedness, uh, the state's ability to, to pay back loans by a certain period of time, which which is not known until later in the year. And, and the tax increases are actually published at the federal level, not the state level. The employers are notified quarterly. Mm -hmm. And so were they notified at the end of December, or are they waiting until the end of March to be notified? The, the federal tax increase is calculated on an annual basis, but it's typically calculated towards the latter stages of a calendar year by the federal government. So the, the state when it issues its communications, does so in a generic fashion such that it, it, it kind of alerts the public to federal tax increases based on the continued indebtedness of the trust fund. So at the latter stage of calendar year 2014, and I think your question, Representative, was the 0.5% increase for calendar year 2014? Yes, sir. That was not calculated by the federal government until, I believe, November of 2014. So the state had no knowledge of the specific tax increase for calendar year 14 until that point, and that's when the federal communication took place. Okay, I guess once again I'll ask the question. If I need to ask it a different way, let me know. When did the State Department of Labor advise employers in Connecticut that the 0.5% was going to be um, a factor in their finances. We did not notify the employers in the state of Connecticut as we were unaware of the 0.5 increase until November of 2014 and the payments were already due by January of, of 2015.